Some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello, and welcome back to the channel, everybody. In today's video, we find ourselves in Las Vegas, Nevada, where Chili De Castro decided he wanted to cross the line with the cops and ended up getting himself arrested for his own damn smart mouth and stupidity. So, let's go ahead and sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. You know what's going on? Take note, frauditors. This man right here, the one with the big camera, is an actual member of the press. You want to know how you can tell the difference between what you do and what they do? This man is not interfering. He's not acting like a complete jackass. He's observing what's going on, and he's going to be filing a report report on what's going on. In addition, he won't be arrested because he goes around acting like a complete dumbass like Chili here or any other frauditor who uh, crosses the line with uh, anybody. So yeah, take note, dumbass frauditors. A little longer than a few minutes later. You could just do your job, mind your own business. That's what you could do. Excuse me? I told you, I would say it again, you could mind your own business. I'm doing my job. I appreciate your time. But just, if I was you, I'd just shut your mouth so I don't put you in your place. Who is he? He's an asshole, sir. I know that. What's his name? That is his name, sir. Asshole. Major asshole. Oh, Chili. Uh, is this the same attitude problem that you had when you tried to become a star in Hollywood? Or, uh... Was it the fact that you uh, have such a sense of entitlement that you decided to, well, try to get away with a lot of things with the Pink Ranger on the set of uh, Power, Power Rangers Wild Force, and that ended up getting you fired all those years ago from Power Rangers? At any rate, you're just a freaking big-ass loser. You were a loser in Hollywood because of your attitude problem and you're a loser throughout your entire life because you have a nasty attitude problem that, well, people just don't find, well, kosher. That's what I'd do if I was you. I'd shut up. If I was you. Unless you want to look like an idiot on YouTube. We're still pretty close to the road, so let's push this out a little bit further. If you yeah. just keep going that way for me, I'm okay if you see no, no. the video over there for Don't me, okay? tell me where to stand. I'm a constitutional law scholar. I'm suing you guys for $5 million. I'll sue you for $5 million more. Oh, you're suing for $5 million. That's right. You know you can sue for all you want, but the question is if you'll win or not. And uh, I don't think you'll win this case because... Well, your win-loss record is quite shoddy at best, my friend. So good luck with that. You don't okay, have a right I'm to not, tell me I'm, what to do. I'm just asking you stand your over there. We're still doing And don't approach me. Tip? Shut your mouth. Sir, do you see the shut your mouth there? and shut your mouth. You I'm your boss. Do you, see the tip you understand that? Well, shut your mouth. I'm walking down the street. Mind your own business. Uh, Chili, uh, I hate to be the bearer of bad news. But uh, I don't think that uh, you should have uploaded the entire video because you were not walking down the street when you confronted these cops. You drove to this location and approached them at your own will. So a little piece of advice, if you're going to lie, don't leave the evidence of your uh, fabrications on the videos that you take because that could possibly be used against you in court, you dumbass. No, I'm just standing I, here. This, if we, you hadn't this, approached me, sergeant. don't come behind me, Piggy. Okay. If, if, if you hadn't approached me, I, wouldn't, I don't give a damn what you are. You're not a sergeant. Shut your mouth. I'm okay. here doing my job. I'm a member of the press. <laughs> oh, wait, you serious? Let me laugh even harder. <laughs> I invoke my First Amendment right. Okay. Now, I invoke my Fifth Amendment right, so don't ask me another question. Take three steps back, gentlemen. Hey, Mr. Constitutional Law Scholar, you do realize that uh, the Fifth Amendment uh, protects you from incriminating yourself in a trial, right? Right? Not out on the streets? I mean, come on now, dude. 
Come on, Mr. Constitutional Law Scholar, get with it. I'm not your suspect. Take three steps back from me. Okay. So there's a crime scene. Take three there, steps back from me. Now, I'm so walking down the street. I can walk okay. anywhere I want. There's so not crime scene right here. Scene. The crime tape would be over here then, wouldn't it? Dunce cap. Sir, I get you didn't graduate from there's high school, crime did you? Crime scene tape right there, okay? We're just asking. You to I don't give a rat's there. ass what you say. Do you understand that? Sir, I don't you care don't what you say. I'm not breaking sir. any laws. Make it difficult. Okay. If you would mind your own damn business, we wouldn't be talking right now. If you hadn't opened your mouth, I wouldn't be talking to you. I'm, I'm just you filming this. And, uh, you're okay to film. I'm a member of I'm the press. I told you, you I invoke my Fifth Amendment right. You have a right to ask me questions. You have your. I got the First Amendment. What are the first five big freedoms of the First Amendment? You have your press. I'm a constitutional law scholar. You dunce cap. What's it like sir, to be so stupid? I wonder what that's like. Yeah, Chili, uh, why don't you go ahead and tell us what it's like to be so damn stupid? I mean, you had a good gig with the Power Rangers, but you fucked that up. And you had other good gigs going in Hollywood until your attitude got you fired from all the others. And, uh, well, the rest is history. So what's it like to be a stupid dunce cap yourself? Right there, what's it like to be a go. moron? You walk what's it like to not know sir, our rights? Correct him. Already, hey, correct him, sir. Correct this man. Explain to him right. that he doesn't have this a right. Don't sir. put your hands on me. You've already walked across the crime scene tape. Are you going to run over and grab me? Are you going to run over and grab me? Sir, I'm walking down the street, gentlemen. I have a right to film this. Keep walking. You understand that? I understand. I'm I have a right to film this. You to if you touch me, I will sue you. You're I see more than you every time. Already, sir. I was walking down the street. I have a right to do so. Okay, but you, we are telling you that you need to Your cop told walking. me to walk over here. I have it on video. Okay, and I understand that. You're confronting me when you should be working on your if job. You, if you Why don't you shut me, your mouth and step away from me? I'm just filming. Let me talk to you, all right? Who's the commanding officer? I am. Okay, then step back from me and leave me alone. I'll stop no. talking to you and I'll keep walking that then way. keep walking. Then go that way. Get out of my face. No, I will stand right here. You can keep walking. You're not my boss, bro. I'm yours. You understand that? I, t I make the rules. I gave you a lawful I'm order. Your you need boss. to keep walking. Uh, yeah, Chili, uh, you are quite delusional. You are nobody's boss. You are just some pissant failed Hollywood actor who lives out of their van and leeches off of anybody that will support him. I mean, that's all you are, a pathetic loser. Le who? The her. Talking. I if am you walking. Do not, then you I'm getting, what's, your name, what's your name and badge I'm number? I'm Sergeant Hutchinson. Okay, what's your name and badge number? What's your name and badge number? Okay, what's your name and badge number? All right. If you would just do your job, if you would just do your, I didn't. Yes, you did. I did not. I have it on video. I, I'm asking you to it's, continue it, walking. It's recorded. Sir, it's recorded. I'm not going that way. I'm going you that can't. way. You can't. No. That's the thing. Okay. Okay. What is the crime scene about? This is a fatal car accident. Okay, so am I in, in any way near the fatal car accident? You are. You or are you are just being a dominating no. pig to me? Please there's just no reason. Walking. There's no reason to try to detain me or arrest me. At all. I've done nothing wrong. I haven't been I'm not, There's no victim. There's no crime here. You're just being a dominating pig. Leave me alone. I have not been disrespectful. All I, I, was, filming, all I was doing is filming the bikes, man. That's all I was doing. And all I asked you was what you were doing. And it's none of your business. Do your job. You don't have to answer to you. You're not my daddy. No, I have the officer over there on video told me to walk this way. Go ahead and arrest me and find out how quick I sue your ass. Sir. Just do it. Okay. okay I have to go walk the other go way. To the so I'm going to be walking over here. Go to the crime scene don't we'll tell me what way. to do. Please go that way. Don't tell me what to do. Then let's just You're not walking. my boss. I'm giving you a lawful order. Let's start walking now. Let's go. We're going this way. Are you going to put your hands on me now? Leave me the fuck alone. Let's go. Go. Let's go. Go. Well, don't touch me, dude. I'm just, I'm dude, just, I'm just I'm standing here. I'm escorting you I'm to where you need to go. Are you guys going to surround me? Leave me alone. I'm escorting you to where There's you no need to go. There's no reason to do this. I'm not trying to fight anybody. I'm There's no victim here. There's no crime. You're just trying to dominate another Let's person. Do just leave me alone. Through. Okay, I can leave, but you don't have to walk okay, up on me. So what's the emergency? Is there an because emergency? Here? Somebody's right. dead, sir. Is okay. that enough emergency? But where are they at? Let's go. Where are they at? Where are they at? Are they right here? Let's go, sir. Am I causing any problems, problem, sir? Let's go. The only thing you're doing is losing your cool, acting like an sir, idiot. The crime is you're right acting here. like Let's a dunce cap. Let's go, sir. You're on camera the acting like a moron, bro. Come on. Uh, no, Chili, uh, that's you. That's you acting like a moron. You walked over here to cause problems and act like a total moron, and you got the response you wanted. But it's going to end up costing you more than, uh, well, you originally wanted. So have fun with your arrest. 
out, sir. No, look at this. I got one, two, three, three four cops. What? What good's it doing? What good's it doing? You're just going you don't need to ask for me. Go back to where you're going. I'm walking. I'm walking right now. Then let's go. Now you're threatening me with violence. Now this guy's threatening me with violence. Now they're put. Now they're pushing me. Look. Look at their hands all over me. Look at that. Look at that. You're right. All we're escorting you. Don't fucking touch me, boys. Don't. Take note, everybody. Chile is a really great example. A really great example of what a really bad attitude can get you out of life. I mean, this guy tried to become a Hollywood actor, and his attitude problems cost him quite a few jobs. And I'm sure this kind of attitude cost him quite a few jobs in uh, other fields as well. I mean, who wants to work with somebody like this? I know I certainly wouldn't. So now all this idiot can do is just go around harassing him cops and uh, getting himself arrested for clicks and views and for uh, fictitious lawsuits. I mean, wow, dude, you are a pathetic loser. So at an area, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching, and I will see you on the next one. Dude, so there's no way I can get in, bro? Come on, I'll put you on my YouTube. But shut up, Wesley. You gotta put signs up, ma'am, if it's- Are you Glenn Serio? Who's that?